Let's convert the decimal 0.31 to a fraction. So to start off, let's just call it 0.31 over 1. Since we're only dividing by 1, we haven't changed the value. It's still 0.31, but now we have the start of a fraction. Next, we need to get this 0.31 to a whole number. We have one, two decimal places. Two decimal places, we're going to multiply by 100. So 100 times 0.31, that gives us that whole number, 31. So now we have the whole number. We can't just multiply the numerator, though, by 100. We also have to multiply the denominator. 100 divided by 100, that's 1. So we haven't changed the value. It's just that we're representing it as a fraction here. So 100 times 1 is 100. And we converted the decimal 0.31 to the fraction 31 over 100. And we can't reduce this here any further. If you divide 31 by 100, you'll get 0.31. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.